Hi YouTube, happy holidays. Today I will show you how to transfer a file from one HP Palm Top to another via the built-in infrared transceivers. This is especially helpful if you don't have a serial cable for one of your Palm Tops. For this test, I'll move a text document from my 100LX on the left to my 95LX on the right via the X modem protocol. First, I'll open Datacom on the 100LX okay, and configure the port for transmission. Okay, I'll go, I went to Menu and then Connect and Settings. Okay, 2400 baud infrared port. Uh, it's important to note 2400 baud is the fastest you can transmit anything over infrared. No parity. Eight data bits, one stop it, and let me go back. Uh, Alt V for advanced, and no flow control, which is fine. And um, okay. Then I'll open Datacom on the 95LX and do the same. Menu settings, configure port interface, infrared. Uh, and uh, no flow control, 2400 baud, one stop it, no parity, eight data bits. Okay. And then I'll double check that that's right. Okay. Yep, all good. Okay, so now what I'll do is set the 100LX to transfer IR test via X modem. First, I need to set the protocol. It's set to X modem. And then I'll go down send and find irtest.txt in the directory A and data. Now I can go Alt F to files, I, and then down from I to irtest.txt. And that's good to go. And in the 95LX, I'll go to the main menu and then transfer X modem receive IR test dot txt. Okay, so now the 95LX is set up to receive it by the same protocol and I'll line up the computers so that the IR receiver and detector match positions on each side. So I'll go ahead and do that and then when you watch the next segment you'll see the proper orientation. Make sure to take a close look at that. Okay, so now I've oriented the 100LX and 95LX so that the transceivers match each other on each side. So go ahead and take a look. That's about the appropriate orientation. You might want to slide them a little bit to make sure that the file was properly transferred. And I'll go ahead and initiate transfer on the 100LX side and initiate receiving the file on the 95LX side. And I can tell it was successful. Okay. So what I'll do in a second is show you the contents of the documents on each side to confirm that the transfer was indeed successful. Alrighty, now let's make sure this transfer was successful. On my 100LX, I'll do type irtest.txt. Great. And then in the C directory, of my 95LX where the file was received, I'll do, oops, do the same. Type irtest.txt. Okay, and the contents are identical. That's great, we are successful. I hope this is helpful to everyone, and once again, thank you for watching.